I think that blind faith is how I've led my life, my entire life. You can't go through life unless you actually have a little bit of blind faith. I've got another confession to make. I'm your fool. Everyone's got the chains to break. Holding you. Were you born to resist? It's been a long time since I put a record out. Um, especially one that I feel quite um, artistically passionate about. Um, since the Anastasia album, I think that's the last, well, The Greatest Hits was probably the last record I put out that I felt as impassioned by. Um, so it's, it, it means a lot just to me as an artist. I allowed um, the direction of my music to, to be altered by the suggestion of the record company. You know, work with different producers, have a little bit of an R&B sound, that kind of thing. So I actually, it's, I didn't know um, what that would do, you know, particularly. And I trusted in their opinion of where music had gone since I had last put out music. But I can't choose. I swear I'll never the, the reason why I was okay with it is because it's a record company that has sold billions and billions of records and why would you question a record company that sold billions and billions of records? It's just, it's kind of silly, you know? So I didn't really question it. I thought, you know what, I'll try it. And it was something I tried, but not something that I really realized I connected as much with as I connect with my soul pop rock Anastasia that I believe I found within my career. I'm always described quite manly in certain ways of my strength and my power and my and my, you know, people have used the word she's ballsy, you know, but I'm like, um, not really ballsy, but, you know, maybe ballsy up here, you know. So I, uh, I think that, uh, that It's a Man's World fits very well with who I am, as well as the fact that I did only men's uh, rock songs on this album. <laughs> I, I just am really grateful to be able to have, number one, just accomplished it. Whether it sells or not, I, these, are, these are all to be determined, but I really do feel very proud of what I'm presenting because I, I believe it. And I have to believe everything that I do ultimately um, in its core, especially a project like this, to, to get away with it, I think. <laughs>